There are many mouths to feed. The clan needs a big kill. Tonight, the hyenas will hunt as a pack. The search for prey takes Twambo's clan dangerously close to rival territory. They are right on the border of Nasanta's clan's hunting ground. Clans are viciously territorial. If they're discovered, a conflict could break out, but it's a risk they are willing to take. They isolate a small herd of wildebeest, seeking out the most vulnerable targets. The clan charges the herd. A cow bolts in panic. A calf is separated from the herd. Both mother and calf fall to the deadly pack. But despite their success, the clan's proximity to rival territory makes them nervous. A violent clash with Nasanta's clan could end in serious injuries. They eat feverishly, dismembering the carcasses in minutes. The powerful jaws crush down with almost half a ton of force tearing through bone and flesh with ease. Despite the feeding frenzy, the hyenas are anxious to avoid being discovered by their rivals. They try to drag the kills back into their own territory before they are spotted. The move comes too late. A territorial patrol from Nasanta's clan has come to investigate. <laughs> the scouts approach with caution as the intruding clan braces for a fight. Tensions are high on both fronts. A few scouts try to approach the kill, but the intruders chase them off. The scouts are grossly outnumbered. They won't win this fight alone, so they retreat. But this battle isn't over yet. The scouts will return with reinforcements. As dawn breaks, Twambo's clan continues its feast. Lulled into false security, they hold their position, still precariously close to enemy territory. By mid-morning, the dregs of the kill are left to the lowest-ranking hyenas of Twambo's clan, who saw little of the lavish feast during the night. But they have overstayed their welcome. The scouts from Nasanta's clan have returned with reinforcements. This territorial infringement will not be taken lightly.
The intruders recognize the danger too late. The full force of Nasanta's clan is upon them. Twambo's father, the intruding clan's alpha male, is in trouble. A large female from the Santa's clan is close on his tail. cornered. The fierce females show him no mercy. They target his spine and ears. This is a fight for his life. As dusk falls, the battered members of Twambo's clan return to the den. Many are wounded, but only one is missing. Twambo's father. Weeks pass before he finally appears, limping and disfigured but alive. His wounds have healed, but they will mark him for life. His ear has been ripped from his head. But the alpha male's injuries are not the worst of the fight. At Nasanta's den to the north, a male hyena's wounds reflect the true horror of the conflict. His nose and lips have been ripped from his face, healing into a permanent snarl. Next to humans, hyenas are probably one of the most fatally aggressive animals on Earth. One day, Twambo will have to breach this deadly territorial rivalry when he leaves to find a mate in a new clan.